our challenge is we're getting rid of the babies. Okay. Honey, you don't need Wappy. You're a big girl. How are those wings, girl? Look at that face. Hey mamas, before watching this vlog, please make sure to give it a thumbs up, press that subscribe button and ring the bell so you're always notified when I have a new vlog up. All right, mamas. So, I have a challenge. Well, Brian and I have a huge challenge. Layla Jane is, uh, she's asking for it right now. Uh, Honey, it's okay, big girls don't need pinkies. Big girls don't need them, you got lovey. Layla, are we gonna go to the pool today? What are we gonna do at the pool today? Okay. Are you gonna jump in the deep end? Well, as you just saw from that, our challenge is we're getting rid of the babies. So Layla Jane is almost two and a half, and our dentist told us it's time, and it's not going very well. It's only 8.30 in the morning, and we're having a hard time already. So we're telling her it's only for nap times and for bedtime, but during the day, big girls don't have wubbies. Can you say, I'm a big girl? I'm a big girl. Good job, you are a big girl. So there are so many different methods that people use. Some use the snip method, which I kind of wanted to do, where you snip it and then they just don't want it. Brian is kind of dead set on, we just don't have it during the day and only let it for naps and bedtimes. So we're gonna try that today and see how it goes, or maybe this weekend. What, honey? What do you want? Oh no, honey, because remember, we're gonna go to the pool. We're gonna go to the pool. And you don't need web in the pool. I'm just trying to use all the distraction techniques I can to get her to realize she doesn't need it. But we're gonna give this a shot, and if it doesn't work, then we'll start doing the snipping. And then, and then I even heard some people put vinegar on it so it doesn't taste good, and then the kid just kind of decides they don't want it. But I guess today we're just gonna try this method where we just try to go cold turkey during the day and just always try to change the subject and keep her interested in something else. It's gonna be a long day, you guys. Ed, you have lovey. Layla, I think we need to go run some errands. Or should we go take Jax on a walk? All right, here Look comes the true Jax test. Jax doesn't have a wubby. We are going out on a walk and going to the store without, you know what? Normally we would never leave the house without that. Layla, where did you become a We big aren't girl? that far from her house and she's already no. crying. We just keep Deep trying down. to emphasize what a big girl. big girl she is, how big girls don't need that. And we keep getting her distracted, but she keeps remembering, but it's just gotta be consistency here. We're about ready to get to the store. She's been pretty good so far. I'm feeling good about this. Can I just say, I love living in an area where we can walk every place. This is great. Except today, it's like nine o'clock right now and it's already 95 degrees. It's hot. <laughs> why don't you do lovey? Is it because you're a big girl? Is that why? Oh, and big girls walk dogs. Big Seriously? girls walk dogs. Now that you have all this free time and hands and mouth. You are such a big girl. Good job. We can do this. Oh yeah, big girls can walk a dog exactly. for sure. <laughs> Layla, can you say bye bye Webby? Good job. Bye bye Webby. Hey, guess what? Because you have no Webby. You can fly higher, because that wubby weighs you down. Oh, that's right, wubbies weigh you down. You can fly down now, yes. Good job. <laughs> what? what? Honey, you remember you don't need wubby. Okay. <laughs> Honey, you don't need wubby, you're a big girl. <laughs> big girls don't use wubbies, <laughs> right? Come on, sweetie. She had just fallen, and that's normally when she would get, you know what? So that was kind of hard. Mm. Oh, but distraction again with some uniform. treats. Take the unit. Oh my gosh. Look at that. 
So yeah, maybe we shouldn't be substituting it with donuts, but you whatever. do what you can in the moment. <laughs> yeah, whatever. We'll deal with her sugar addiction another day. <laughs> Guess who you get for your nap? A donut. Not a donut, but a wubby. Do you want wubby for your nap? Do you want wubby for nap time? Okay, then after nap time, wubby goes away again because we're gonna go to the pool. Only because it's nap time, you get wubby. But remember, after nap, it goes away. All right, we made it to nap time. It was a little rough. I mean, she definitely had her moments where she was asking for Webby, but I'm actually really surprised how easily we were able to distract her. I think the hardest part was when she fell because she wanted that comfort of Webby, but you know, I just gave her extra snuggles and of course we used the candy to distract her, which might not have been the best decision, but in the moment it worked. Um, but this is, I, I don't want to jinx it, but we're doing pretty well so far. And for all of you guys who have watched me, you know how obsessed she is with her binkies. Pretty much every video, every vlog I do, every picture I take, she has one in her mouth. So I thought this was going to be a disaster today. So it just goes to show you, even a kid who is obsessed with their binky, it is possible to go cold turkey during the day. Did you have a good nap? Oh, you look so happy. You had it. Well, it wasn't your longest nap, but that's okay. We'll take it. But uh oh, you know what happens. Hey, now that we're done with sleepy time, well, he's got to get ready for bedtime for later. Can we have him? Now let's go get those wings with pepper and cheese. Okay. Oh, distraction. You ready? Yeah, go oh, get chicken see, wings see, with see, daddy. Good girl. See, good girl. Big girl. Big girl. Crust. Are you so excited? Uh -huh. <laughs> so Brian is the king at distraction. He's always been so good at making her happy in just a second. So I'm kind of glad he's here to help me with all this. I'm good too, but not like Brian. Parmesan crusted chicken wings, girl. Yeah, it's hot. We don't touch that. Say hot. Hot. We don't touch. She takes after her daddy and loves chicken wings. And it's actually really kind of fun to give to a toddler. Uh, because she'll just hold on to it and she'll nod it forever and it keeps her busy, it keeps her entertained. So a little tip there for you, if you're ever at a restaurant, get chicken wings for your toddler. They'll sit there and just eat it and snack on it and it'll keep them kind of quiet for a little bit. How is that, girl? Mm -hmm. That was a good bite. High five to that bite. <laughs> Look at that face. <laughs> you would never know we are in the process of weaning her off of you know what. Now the next trick though is we are gonna be going on a car ride. Daddy. She usually always has a you car ride too. Here we go, so far so good. First place we're going is Target, which is um, less than a mile away. So this should be doable. And yeah, normally we would walk, but like I mentioned earlier, now it's 101 degrees, so there's no way we're walking. Look at those teeth. Can you give me a big smile? <laughs> Are you having a fun time? Yeah. Are you watching Blippi? Yeah. And you just have Lovey, huh? awesome job. We were in the car for a long time having to run a lot of errands. She never once cried for it. She did so awesome. And so as a little reward, I am going to make her these little um, pops, like homemade popsicles. But they are so cool because they're like ring pops. I've never seen them before. They're actually my neighbors and I'm borrowing them from her. Because I thought it'd be something fun, you know, something that she can suck on, kind of like the one. I don't want to say it too loud or binky. But at least it'll be healthier and it won't be the whoopee. I don't know if she'll like this, so I'm just going to make a few of them. I'm just going to use one of these Danimal yogurt pouches. I'm going to put these in the freezer and we're going to the pool now, so hopefully they'll be all set by the time we get back. And I'm definitely not worried about her at the pool because when she's there, she doesn't care at all about Webby or Webby. So I know we'll be fine there.
We are back from the pool, all fresh and clean and showered. We were there for like an hour. She had so much fun. But she's already asking for Lubby. So I'm gonna try to see if these little ring pop popsicles are done. Let's see if I can distract her with this. We'll see. Look how cute this is! <laughs> Layla, it's a popsicle! Isn't that cool? Oh my lord. Cheers. <laughs> the guy that marries you better give you that ring. <laughs> oh daddy. Is that good? These are so cool, and my friend bought them at Target, but unfortunately, I don't think Target sells them anymore, so I'm gonna have to look on Amazon, because <clears throat> these are awesome, and I need some for her. <laughs> this is a great way to get her to like eat yogurt and smoothies, things like that with some hidden fruits and veggies in them. This is awesome, and it took her mind off Wubby. You guys, we made it to dinner time. This wasn't so bad. Like, I'm telling you, I mean, we still got a few more days to go, but, but then we're gonna gradually go into phase two where we nix the button up from bedtime and nap time. But right now, this daytime one wasn't as nearly as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Going cold turkey was not bad. So I give credit to Brian, because this was his idea. I wanted to do the gradual approach. So I, I admit when I'm wrong, <laughs> he was right. Hey, today was a good day. Uh, it was, it was, it was much easier than I thought it was gonna be. But keep following us because I'm gonna keep giving you updates. Um, but thanks for joining us today. Let me know if you try this with your kids too. Just starting off with just keeping it away from them during the daytime when they're awake. But thanks again for watching. Please make sure to like and subscribe and follow us on Instagram at HeyMamas18. Bye everyone.